Hi everybody and welcome to this short workout focusing on upper body strength and shoulder stability. So you will need the usual small hat cushion or folded towel, the block or pillow to align yourself better. In addition, you can choose to practice these exercises with a small weight. So prepare two small weights, about half a kilo. You can use a half a liter water bottle as well. So let's get started in all fours position. Placing your hands slightly further forward than your shoulders, knees underneath your hips, feet relaxed. Gently round your back up towards the ceiling, pushing yourself up and away from the ground. Then slowly lower back down a couple of times, engaging your core, rounding your back. Keep the position for deep inhalation, then slowly lower back down one more time. Push yourself away from the ground, pressing your hands into your mat, hold, then slowly lower down, this time only halfway, keeping your back straight parallel to the floor, tummy engaging, supporting and slightly lifting your lower back away from your mat. Hold the position, then focus on your mid back. Imagine Full tray of rings, balancing on your sacrum and lower back while slowly sinking your chest down in between your shoulders, then push yourself up and away. A few more, lower down, then push away. We're going to keep the elbow straight in this position. So only sliding the shoulder blades towards each other, then away from each other. A few times. Good. Keeping your back and the back of your neck nice and long. Staring at one spot in between your hands. Good job. Slowly lower, then push yourself up and away. Round your back. And shift your weight back over your heels into child position. From here, we're going to reach a little further forward with the right, then release, then with the left hand, then release. Add a gentle stretch to the muscles around your shoulder, reach and release. Great job, reach. And release, or we'll have one more, reaching with the left, then moving back to the center. Press both palms into the ground, open up your chest, then pull yourself up in the all fours position, dropping your elbows down, holding the position, your back slightly tilted forward, nice and straight, reaching the right arm forward. Then the left leg backwards, keeping your back straight and release. Reach and lengthen, other way around, left arm, right leg and change. Reach, nice long back, nice long neck. If you're okay, you can balance and reach your leg. Perhaps even your arm away, and then release. Add way around, reach, and then release. One more each side. Release, and then reach again. Floating the leg and the arm away from the ground, then slowly lower it down, folding the knees. Then push yourself up into all fours position and slowly lower yourself down forearms and same on the other side. Push back up, one and the other hand. Now we're going to continue similar movements than we did before, sliding the right arm forward Lowering your chest down towards the ground. This time we're going to fold opposite arm, reach the left arm, lower down, and then push back up. Reach, extending the opposite leg, and then push back up. 
We reach. Push back up. We reach. Push back up. One more. Each side. Keeping your back nice and long. Your arm, your torso will create one straight line. Then slowly push back up. Great job. Hold the all fours position. Pick up one weight into your left hand. Keeping your back straight and pull the left elbow up and over. And then release. Open. Down, release. Two more here. Open. Down, release. Extending your leg. Same movement. Reach. Open. Then release. Two more. Open. Release. Last one. Open. Down, release. Same arm reaching forward. Floating the leg, floating the arm up and then keep them straight, lower down. Lift and lower, lift and lower, one more, lift and then lower down. Great job. So upside and grab uh, the weight in your left hand, keeping your back straight and pull your elbow up and backwards and lower it down. Open the chest towards the right side slightly. Open. Then center. We have one more here. Open. Then center. Same arm movement, extending the opposite left leg, keeping the toes on the ground for extra support. Pull and release. Two more. Pull and release, pushing yourself up and away from the ground, and down release, reaching the right arm forward, floating the leg up, then lower back down, up, then lower back down, two more, up, lower down, one more, up, and then lower back down, great job, fold the knees, Walk your hands backwards, grab both ways, relax the shoulders. If you feel more comfortable, you can use your pillow or the block. Place it in between your hips and heels. Relax the shoulders. Flow the arms forward with or without the weight. And reach the right arm forward, center, left arm forward and center. Reach, keeping the arms parallel to the ground, one and the other arm. Forward, forward, back nice and long. We have one more, then reach both arms up and over, sideways down, up and over. Sideways down, up and over, lift your hips up, and then lower the arms down, and lean forward, hold from the hips and knees, keeping your back straight, arms reaching backwards and downwards, start your hundreds, moving the shoulder blades towards each other, small pulsing motion, inhale for five, Exhale for five with the palms facing backwards. Five little movements as you inhale. Five little movements as you exhale. And then I'm going to reach both arms up and over. Circle the arms around. One more. Circle the arms around. And this time turn the palms forward. Leaning forward. Open up your chest. 
and start the pulsing motions. Inhale for five, exhale for five. Inhale for five, exhale for five. Two more deep inhalation, keeping your back straight. Very good. Reach all the way back up. Relax the arms by your side and drop the weights down. You can find a comfortable seated position of your choice. You can use the pillow or the block to sit up a little higher. Relax the shoulders. Add a couple of gentle stretches, reaching the right arm up and over. Fold the elbow and stabilize your elbow with your left hand. Holding the position. Inhale and long exhalation. Keep your back nice and straight. And then reach the palms away from each other. Imagine pushing two walls away. And lower your hands down, reaching the left arm up and over, elongating the side of your torso. Fold reaching towards your mid-back and stabilize your elbow. Hold the position. Deep inhalation. Long exhalation. Good. We'll have one more. Inhale. And exhale. Reach away. This time we're going to drop the hand. So aiming the fingers downwards. Reach with the back of your hands away from your chest. Then cross your right arm. Cuddle it with your left and hold. A nice long deep inhalation. Long exhalation, enjoying that nice stretch to the side of your shoulder. Open up, reached palms away, moving the arms backwards, then cross your left arm, cuddle it with your right, dropping the shoulder away, maintain a nice upright position, hold. Maybe imagine balancing a book on top of your head. Inhale and exhale. We have one more here. Deep inhalation. Long exhalation. Open up the arms. Lower your palms down. Reach and lift the upper part of your chest towards the ceiling. Then raise your arms over your head. Palms together. Lower your hands down in front of your chest. Great job. Thank you very much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed this short workout and you feel a little bit stronger in the upper body. See you next time. Bye. If you enjoyed this class, please like and share this video with others and subscribe to our channel for more workouts like this. We would love to hear about your experience too, so please leave a comment below. Thank you very much. Your feedback means a lot to us. Have a lovely day.